Hi, welcome to another episode of Hot Takes. And five has become four. With Mel Stride now out of the race to become the leader of the Tory party, there are but four remaining contenders. Robert Jenrick is now favourite. Kemi Badenoch is second favourite, but unlikely to get onto the ballot. Uh, James Cleverly is third, and Tom Tug on that last in fourth. However, uh, we all know that this was just at the vote to get rid of Stride. Now the last four are there, something strange happens. They have to have the beauty contest. They have to go to the Conservative Party conference. Uh, and then I think there's three events. One is um, a Q&A. Uh, one is um, a presentation. And then one is a speech that each of them do lasting around 20 minutes to the conference. And so all those attending will be, of course, bored out of their tiny minds. Uh, but it does mean that at the end, they will um, have a little internal election with the MPs, only the MPs, not the delegates, not anyone who attends, only the MPs will vote to see which of those four goes through. Two of them go through onto the final ballot. Now, Tom Tug on that reckons he's in with a chance and Jenrick also in with a chance. However, the rank and file members really do want Kemi Badenoch. If she's not in the last two, it's going to be very bad news for the Conservative Party. It will be the tipping point, uh, be the inflection point, if you will, for a lot of members who will then just jump ship and go straight to reform. And I think possibly, and it's been linked as well, Kemi also may well cross the floor because she knows that she's popular with the rank and file members just not with the MPs. And if she can't work with her own MPs, what's the point of her being there? The trouble for the wets is they know if they put Kemi on the ballot, she will win. And they won't have a One Nation wet Tory leader. You'll actually have a Conservative leading the Conservative Party. And I don't think they're ready for that. They don't like the idea of the Conservative Party being led by an actual, genuine Conservative. Oh, it's all very complex, isn't it? These games they play. What do they do? Lose and have Kemi or win and destroy the party. Uh, what it is to be a Conservative MP with such a difficult choice. We'll find out soon. Their party conference is next week. And that's when it all goes, well, wrong either way. Thanks a lot. Bye.